Hello students, welcome to the next lecture on the GATE 2022 statistics. Today we will discuss about question number 37 related to the conditional convergent. Again we will solve this question within a 15 second so that you may remember this shortcut to explain. You can simply follow my telegram link where you can find the various discussions related to the GATE examinations as well as you can simply follow my YouTube channel link Dr. Harishkar where you can find the previous year lectures on all these papers. So let's start with this question number 37 which we can solve within a fraction of a second. So what is your target is? Your target is to prove the series which of the following series is conditional convergent. So let me firstly tell you what is the meaning of this conditional convergent. In order to prove that whether the series is conditional convergent you have to prove the two things. Firstly you have to prove this series is convergent and mod of this is divergent. So this is the way you have to prove these things. You have to prove this series is convergent and their absolute value is divergent. So anything which satisfies this condition is called as conditional convergent. Now here is minus 1 raised to power n. So it means you have to apply the Leibniz test for the first part. What is the Leibniz test is? You have to firstly prove a n is a decreasing. Second is a n goes to the 0 as n approaches infinity and a n is a positive sequence. So clearly says that this is my positive because n varies from 0 to infinity. Again it, you can see that it's a decreasing sequence because the denominator is a higher degree than of the numerator. So it's here and also what will happen when you take n approaches infinity. So it's a 1 upon n that's a 0 so that will goes to the 0. So it means this is my convergent. The S1 is my convergent. Is it now what is the mode of this? If you take the mode of this what will happen? This is nothing but my n upon n square plus 4. Clearly says that this is a divergent series. If you consider b of n is 1 by n and by using the p test, it is my divergent. So it means mod of a n is my divergent. It means s1 is conditional convergent. So s2 is the only, that's a wrong answer. Both s1 and s2, neither s1 and s2. So that is also be the wrong answer. So either s1 or now you can check here. Check about this again. So I can write this series. I can ex I can rationalize them. So I can write this series as at plus of n. Clearly says that this is my decreasing sequence. This goes to the zero as n approaches infinity, and this is always positive from zero to here. So it means this series is my convergent by using the Leibniz test. What will happen if you consider the mode? So if you consider the mode, then it will only give you n square plus n plus here. Now is it the convergent? So clearly says that if you again consider my say b of n is my 1 by n again then you can say this is my a n, a n upon b n as limit n approaches infinity will goes to the finite. So it means by the limit comparison test but this is my divergent by the p test. So it means this series mode of this series is divergent. It means this condition also satisfied. So S2 is also the conditional convergent. So it means both are the correct options. A also cancel out. The right answer is my C is the correct. So I hope you can simply learn this two concept in a very simple manner. We will see some more lectures in our next class 38, 39 and many more with the help of the shortcut tricks. You can simply follow my playlist GERC statistics or the GERC playlist is there channel name this where you can find the various previous year videos. I hope you can like share and comment these videos. Best of luck students. Happy learning.